Okay, that's cool. <laughs> Hello everyone, how are you all doing today? Kamikathy here with more Splatoon 3. Ink Obelisk Square is open up again, and we're gonna go visit it. We're just gonna put on some clothes that seem more uh, appropriate to who we once were back then. Uh, let's see, what did we wear back then? Oh yeah, that was our shirt back then. And we've always been motto boot people around here. I am legitimately trying to remember what I wore uh, back in Splatoon 3 time. Actually, no. No, I think the Punk Knights fit up well. And we didn't use a Splatbrella. We used... Oh, there it is. We used the good old neo Splushomatic. The special may have changed, but this is the weapon we use, so... This, this looks like about what we had when we uh, last were in Inkopolis Square. They said the train is here. I wonder what it's like. I wonder how it's, uh, how it's changed. It's been a couple of years since we've been there. Especially since the uh, last Splatfest. Order versus Chaos. Chaos ended up winning. I wonder how that affected things. Let's go. That's a name I haven't heard in a long while. Yeah, of course I didn't find Lie back down? No, I, I actually get to stand up now. Well, let's change up the eyebrows a little bit. Actually, that's a good question. Were we besties with... I, you know what? I think we were besties with Pearl back in the old DLC. No, I remember Pearl Marina. Off the hook. 
just you don't look like Pearl. Yeah, that's obviously Pearl Marina. sector. This place looks so weird. Very unsettling. What, what was that? All these blips and bloops? What, what is going on here? What happened to all the buildings? What happened to all the people? What in the world is going on? down the sign. Can't even get up to where Grizzco used to be. You can sort of make out the Grizzco logo up there. Then again, that's actually no surprise. Grizzco is always closed back in Splatoon 2. And over here is where the train was. This was a coffee shop where Spike was working on his next play. That's where the DLC uh, Octo Expansion was. There was an arcade cabinet around here somewhere. That's where you guys did uh, off the hook. This was the uh, local multiplayer area. There was an amiibo box around here somewhere. Surprised that's completely gone. These were all the clothing stores and ammo nights. Yeah. But all the white, all the calm, all the quiet. This isn't how I remember this at all. Remember it bustling, colorful. Let's see what's going on. Well, this I don't. That's I don't remember this at all. I'm gonna guess that's water, and that's probably bad. Uh oh. Um. Okay, dualies. I can work with this. So yeah, that's a good point. Where did you get this weapon from? Okay, well... Hmm. Oh, I have a special meter and... Curling bombs. Ink is also very white. Let's go in the elevator. Oh! Hello, 
you. Sucked into what? Nice to meet you. Good. Okay, why? How do you know how to do all this, Pearl? Kind of what I expected. Let's be honest. I mean, for a little bit of meta commentary, I've been solving this world's problems since the Wii U days. Yeah, that's a really dull design, right? as I can get. First floor. Easy. Okay, I can destroy a portal. That's easy enough. More damage from distance. That's fun. Well, let's see. Real eight. If I get really close. Yeah, two forty. Okay, cool. So yeah. Oh yeah, because that's not scary or foreboding. Interesting toys around here. Rock puzzles and the like. easy enough. Alright. Fun. Should have looked around at the background a little bit more. 
There was a lot of old block toys. Okay, neat. So when they get my ink, instead of 100%, it goes up to 400%, so that'll help out a lot. Alright, so I only have the one. Let's go there. So you get your power up before the floor. Interesting. Okay, so more portals. That was the plan. Oh, cool, it's the same general background. Yeah, it's a lot of old wooden block toys. Oh, and you're walled off. Cool, so you can't accidentally walk off the side on this chunk. Alright, now that I know how this works, what we're going to do is we're going to start from the bottom. We got poison ink. Nice. I mean, I'm sure I'm going to reach the top eventually. Okay, how does an elevator tell you all this? I mean, yeah, wasn't Marina part of the actual Octavian Empire? Lucky bomb drop. Interesting. Well, let's take care of it. Ooh, this is a hard floor. What's that thing in the back there? Interesting. Alright, let's get to it.
you know? <laughs> Well, that was simple enough. They said that was a hard mission. Come on. <coughs> okay, what's the next floor now? Okay, so, yeah, what's the reward about? Don't worry, I will definitely pause when it is time. But for right now, we're gonna keep going. Okay, so it's just splat zones. That's easy enough. Yeah, I'm about to say. Alright, so press B in midair to hang on to Pearl. That's fun. Super simple. <laughs> I think, yeah, so far, easy enough. But then again, I'm going to guess this is going to get extremely hard. Hey, it's nice to have a companion for once. Wow, nice. Spinning floor, though. Let's see how this works out. Gauge is full. Cool. But what's the other gauge above it? Turbine tower to the goal. Oh, I get it now. I was like, yeah, I get, I get it now. Start one. Start two. How do 
try and get up there. Easy enough. I just had no idea about the bounce pad little enemy things. Good to learn about those. Well, yeah, of course she's a musician. Pearl is an excellent rapper. pick this up in the next episode thank you all so much for watching i hope everyone has a wonderful rest of their day and i'll see you all next time